We start with that uh, developing news out of Peshawar. Gunshots and two bomb blasts have been heard in the Pakistani city. A standoff is ongoing between gunmen and security forces outside a political agent's office in the city. Now, we're getting reports that um, four people have been killed, at least seven injured in the attacks. Let's bring in Al Jazeera's Imran Khan, who's live for us in Islamabad. It's clear that some major incident is underway there in Peshawar. What, what do we know, Imran? Well, what we know is that a little over an hour and a half ago, gunmen wearing police uniforms stormed into this compound in the center of Peshawar. Now, this is a government compound housing what's known as the political agent. Now, that's the government's representative in the tribal areas of Pakistan. At the time, there was a meeting going on between tribal representatives coming in from Khyber Agency and that political agent. So it looks like that meeting was the target. They stormed in. Now, police say that there were two suicide bombers. They say that one of the suicide bombers managed to explode his uh, vest, but they not, they're not sure about whether the second suicide bomber has actually exploded his vest or not. We have heard two explosions, so it could like, it's likely that that is the case. Now, the gunmen are, try, are still fighting with police there. Ambulances are coming in and out, and the entire area has been cordoned off. So it's a very, very serious attack, and a very major one. But what's worrying is the fact that these people, these gunmen, were wearing police uniforms. Who might have been behind such a, a, an attack such as this, Imran? Well, there are several suspects in this. Now, what's happening in the Khyber Agency, which is the, the agency where the political agent uh, comes from and represents for the government, uh, there's a military operation ongoing against elements linked to the Pakistani Taliban there. So it's likely that it could be some group that was linked to them, or at least a, a group that had grievances against Pakistan's army being in that part of the world. Also, it's, it could well be to do with something a bit more tribal. There were tribal representatives at uh, the meeting that was taking place in that compound. It could be some rivalry there. There's no real indication of who's involved, but it is likely to be elements linked to the Pakistani Taliban in either case. Imran, many thanks indeed. Imran Khan, live there in Islamabad.